The following is rated S for spoilers. From the gaming giant known for curb stomping the competition, comes a new spin jump on their most beloved series that takes gamers on a 2D platforming journey through exciting new locations with all their favorite characters and ask the question on the top of every fan's minds. What that trunk do? Super Mario Brothers Wonder. Pipe up your way out of the Mushroom Kingdom and into the Flower Kingdom, an idyllic land ruled by Prince Florian, a caterpillar responsible for keeping his food, I mean plant-based subjects, happy. Of course, when Florian does a Tony Stark-style demonstration of the Wonder Flower's wonder powers, a move that could at best be described as a threat, he gets interrupted by everyone's favorite lizard daddy, going full calamity Ganon, because becoming an evil castle is easier than going to therapy, I guess. Ah, <sighs> Bowser, buddy, for the last time, you can't love someone else until you learn to love yourself. Also, maybe try downloading Grinder. Jump and dash your way through one of the million new Mario properties this year, except this one isn't a remake, isn't a theme park, and it doesn't have Chris Pratt making Joss Whedon style so that just happened jokes direct to camera. Oh, okay, so these bricks are just floating here. So it's better. Return to the familiar comfort of Mario's gameplay, a 40 year exercise and not fixing something that ain't broke, with the occasional new added feature, like badges which give you unique powers such as jump more, water level, and don't die. And be sure to take advantage of the new in-round power-ups, like TVA Death Bubble, Inflation Fetish, and just straight up killing your enemies in their sleep. And if you get stuck, some condescending daffodil will speak to you in the startling voice of an adult human man. Say the ocean tastes like tears. Also, you can better collect Prince Florian's special royal seed while tripping absolute balls. And we're sure this game is for kids? Okay. Honestly, all we need now is the ability to stack power-ups. Being an elephant is great, but imagine being a flaming elephant. Shooting fire from your trunk? Now that will have Bowser running scared. Team up with your friends to take Bowser down in a local co-op experience that will teach you the importance of being the best gamer you know. That is, if you care about actually seeing what you're doing. Or ditch your IRL pals for the online multiplayer which turns every fight into the Elden Ring of platforming games because you'll watch a mysterious stranger kill the boss for you and then reap the reward. Hey, I don't know what this guy's got going on in his life, so who am I to take that from him? See you in hell, baby Bowser! So smash those brick blocks, call up your local plumber, and get ready to learn some weird new stuff about yourself in a return to form for your dad's favorite video game, which seemed a lot easier back before you had a million ways to compare yourself to all the better players out there. You know, nothing quite makes me feel like more of a gamer than watching a Korean 12-year-old beat me at a game I've been playing longer than they've been alive. Starring Red Mario Green Mario Girl Mario I Like Girls Mario We're Back, A Mario Story Cordyceps Mario Dilf Mario Dilf Mario Head Son Monarchist Mario And Silly Nabbit, Mario is for Kids Super Mario Bros. Operation Dumbo Hip Drop. So basically, this plot boils down to Bowser hotboxing everyone around him, but also is mostly about Nintendo running out of ways to make Bowser the baddie. Just saying, this feels like a couple steps shy of Super Mario Bros. Bowser sells NFTs. Uh, actually, that might already be happening. Comment below on what you want to hear in my epic voice and check out these other epic gaming videos on GameSpot. Because bears hate Christmas. You have been a naughty wooden mechanic boy. Okay, before we get down to business, there's something I have to tell you. I'm fresh out of honey. Pinocchio, use my pee organ. It's a me, Waluigi.